Hey guys, this is Salamander Anagram with ReactorTutorials.com and in this video I'll show you how to implement filter tracking in Reactor. This is a pretty simple operation, it'll just take a few minutes. So first of all we need a filter and we can create a knob for the pitch cutoff point simply by right clicking and choosing create control. And what filter tracking does is it changes the cutoff point depending on the incoming pitch. So we're going to create a note pitch module and I'm going to subtract 60 from it. And when we can take the output of the subtraction and add it to our pitch cutoff to get a very simple pitch tracking algorithm. And so what this will do is whenever the pitch is above 60, um, the cutoff point will be raised. And whenever the incoming pitch is below 60, it'll be lowered. So that's the easiest way to implement filter tracking. A very simple way to make it a little more powerful so the user has a little more control is to multiply the output of the subtraction by a knob ranging from 0 to 1. And this allows the user to control the depth of the filter tracking. And you can also replace the value of 60 with a knob that allows the user to control the center point of the filter as well. So that's how to implement filter tracking in Reactor. Once again, this is Salamander Anagram with ReactorTutorials.com.